Hello and welcome. You're with us here for yet another edition of Cryptonomics brought to you by CoinDCX and Business Today. Joining us on the show, Vivek Gupta, EVP Engineering at CoinDCX. Vivek, great to have you with us. So much that's been going on in the crypto world. Let's pick up uh, you know, blockchain technology and why overall you feel this is gaining prominence. Because if we step away just from uh, the trading uh, news for a moment and we look a little deeper at the technology and its merits for the future, uh, you know, talk to us about why this continues to grow. Sure. Uh, thank you for having me here, uh, Appa. Uh, in most simple words, right, uh, blockchain technology is a distributed, uh, decentralized public ledger that exists across a network. Right? So when you look at this definition, the key tenets that come from it is that it's public, it's accessible to all, it is cryptographically secured, it is immutable. In other words, it cannot be modified once stored and it is totally decentralized, right? So when you look at it, when you think about it, right? Uh, a decentralized shared ledger that cannot be modified and is cryptographically secure, the potential of what you can do, the power that comes from this very simple technology is immense, right? It promises transparency, it promises traceability, and most importantly, it promises decentralization, right? So which shifts the control back into the hands of the participants of the ecosystem. Fundamentally, this creates a more efficient and a more fair way or more fair way of doing things for everyone that's included or involved in the ecosystem. Therefore, this is what I think is driving the innovation, disruption, and as a result, the growing adoption of that entire ecosystem. You know, when we're looking a look at India's next phase of growth as well, and you sound, you know, so impassioned in terms of how we can really, uh, you know, uh, contribute and create through this technology. Uh, but talk to us about the kind of role uh, that we can really see Web3 and blockchain technology playing in empowering India's growth story. Sure. So see, India is already witnessing a dramatic rise, right? I mean, basically, if you look at India, India is basically growing itself into this global Web 3.0 hub. You know, Web 3.0 is already drawing significant attention in the uh, Indian startup ecosystem. Uh, we have seen uh, investments what in in excess of 500 billion dollars in the past few months um, in fact we at coin dcx ourselves have very recently launched coin dcx ventures right this is basically launched to support the growth and development of budding startup ecosystem uh, india and globally everywhere um, adoption is growing also rapidly in india investments made by indians in cryptos alone is in excess of 10 billion us dollars uh, we are ranked number two in worldwide crypto adoption uh, India is also, you know, touted to become a uh, three, uh, five billion dollar economy by 2024-25, and uh, blockchain has the potential to play an integral role towards its growth. Mm. Right? It is estimated that government-related blockchain projects could add 5.1 billion dollar to India's GDP in 2022. Uh, even today, uh, India is like the uh, workforce for global, uh, you know, tech. Right? Basically, be it the Twitter of the world, be it the Facebook of the world. Basically, uh, you, you you will see that there are Indians everywhere. India plays a key role in uh, driving innovation globally forward. Um, but in when it comes to Web 3.0, I think we have an opportunity to uh, be the next Facebook, right? So be the next Facebook, be the next Amazon, be the next Google of the world. All of that could actually be coming out from the Web 3.0 ecosystem in India. Right. Um, and while this opportunity exists, it's not to say that it's without any challenge. Uh, for one, we need to have sustained investment in building and growing our strong talent. Right. I mean, we already have a thriving ecosystem. Yeah. Uh, we will see many more startups coming out of India. And so we need to continue to grow and build on talent to support this growth in India. Um, we also need to have regulated clarity, right? And basically, from the government, uh, that will go a long way in driving forward an exponential growth in blockchain innovation coming out of India. Right? So combined, I think in my opinion, combined with India's technology muscle, a very young demographic, I see a huge potential for India to establish itself as a global leader in driving forward Web 3.0 innovation. All right, Vivek, pleasure speaking with you. Thanks so much for joining us on this edition of Cryptomonomics and look forward to seeing how some of this uh, unravels over the next few weeks and months. Thank you.